Did I look at that? Almost forgot what Kate looks like when she smiles. Yeah, I did. So when do I have to look at everything again? Or when did you want me to look at everything again anyway? Is that later when I come back and see her again? It's way too emo in here. Kate isn't that gloomy. Open Until it then. lately. Open it. Damn, it's the all-American zombie family. It feels like she's saying all the same stuff again. Kate used to play the violin every morning. She stopped last week. Tissues. That's a lot of tears. She's going to go through boxes. Yeah, I guess later. Because they all seem to be saying the same stuff. Why did she cover up the mirror? Oh. She can't look at herself? Hopefully the chat didn't break. Pay attention. Oh great, I'm doomed, I can't pay attention. Ah, Max food, two whales. See you there. Don't let your fingers texting. Yay breakfast. No emoji. Too late. What, when is this? Wait, when did this happen? Well, I've already forgotten everything. Probably. Oh, that's new. Is this new? I don't know. Can't go back that far. No, I'm not going to read it all out loud. Warn you about the floating joint. Yes, I remember that at least. I only remember the funny moments. Eat an arse bas bastard. What? An arse buster. It's good to have minions. Yeah, it is. Especially demonic ones. Oh, b master. Getting good. Lesbian. Oh. Why are we meeting at the diner? Aren't we going to school? Hi, Mum. Hey, honey. I hope you didn't forget to water the plant I gave you. Even with all this crazy shit going on, it is so cool having Chloe back in my life again. Is it? Like no time has passed. I guess so. Have you got anything new to say after I'm more clean? Let's talk later, Max. Okay, bye. Hi. I don't have time, Max. Oh. I can't talk now. Well, clearly I've got time. You're just standing there doing nothing. Bye. Taylor is no doubt being led around by Victoria, as usual. Stella Bottom Tile. Go away. Shit. Clearly not a morning person. Alright, bye then. Wait. Samuel? Oi! Try to look at the bin. Bye, butane. I don't know if I'd rather have demonic minions or be a minion to a demon. Shiny floor. Now I have to talk to everyone again. Squirrel! Eat it! Man, what a fun day this is already. I don't think I've actually seen Taylor alone without Team Victoria. Hi, sub bitch. Hi, Taylor. Why would you even talk to me after the shit you pulled yesterday with Victoria? Because, uh, yeah. I don't want to fight with you or Victoria. Instead of smack talk, let's just talk. For once. You're funny. Well, I'm not doing anything at the moment. So talk. There you are. You're sitting. Kate is really upset about the video. All this gossip is cruel. Boo-hoo. That's what happens when you preach to everybody about sex. She'll live. Why do you hang out with Victoria? She probably won't. She's pretty mean to you and Courtney. 
And she's bossy too. Look, you don't know her. I do. And she's one of the best friends you can have. I know her as much as I care to. Probably a bit more, actually. I guess I've had mean, bossy best friends too. Better than having mean, bossy parents. I would love it if my mom was mean or bossy instead of sick. But whatever. We've had our talk. Alright, see ya then. Well, I don't want to rewind the conversation. Hi, Mr. Caretaker. The birds are flocking around Samuel. No, they're not. There's just two of them on the seat next to him. Is that a flock? Ah, there's Samuel, up early, already communing with the critters. Hey, Samuel, you're up early. Oh, hello, young Max. Hello. I love you every morning. Everything is so calm and quiet. And I can feel the animals waking up with me. Snow. So, what did you think about that freak snow shower yesterday? Another message from the Earth to get our shit together. I will say that Samuel hasn't seen anything like that before. Wait, what? Wait, did you go away as well? Bunny and or senpai, I don't know. Welcome back anyway, if you did. That's one thing I truly love about Arcadia Bay. It's all those cool animals in the forest. The squirrels always come in the morning for food. I can hear them whisper. No, you can't. What animals do you see in the forest? You're just a weird janitor man. I saw a doe, a deer, a female deer. Don't laugh, but I saw a doe that seemed to be looking right at me. Like it was trying to communicate. Oh, that's your spirit animal. Oh. Nothing weird there except you saw yours. That is weird. Could be a sign about your destiny. <laughs> what do I know? Not a lot. My spirit animal is a squirrel. I so don't want to get in the way of your morning ritual. See you later. Of course you will. Can't my spirit animal be a crocodile instead, please? The paint job looks great. Samuel knows his color schemes. Does he? I don't know. Subjective. Samuel really should keep this locked. It's a waiting accident. Can I have and it? too easy to sneak into. And kill Victoria. And get expelled. For the bad ending. I definitely won't play with this thing again. I hope we do. I can see that Samuel's concerned, but... Does he need a poster? Probably got the hots for her. What if he's the one who kidnapped her? He's got a creepy voice. How did Samuel get photos of Rachel posing? I don't know. Who's Rachel? I don't remember. Is Rachel the missing girl? I've never seen Samuel wearing shades. And what's with this other crap? Yeah, there's something creepy going on with this guy. Maybe he's just that stereotypical weird janitor man. Release the Kraken! What? Come on, squirrels. Time for your 15 minutes of fame. You touched the trash. Come and get it. Photo. Photo. Yes! Another Pulitzer for the portfolio. That was such a stock sound effect. Full exposure. Boo! Warren told me that totem is named Tabanga for a reason nobody knows. Well, find out. Can't Blackwell have at least one no football zone? Yeah, there's a lot of no football zones. Look, there's no football here, no football there, no football in your hair. In fact, there's only one football right there. It's like 99.9999999% no football zones around here. Nah, I, I played through the base game of For Honor. And it was pretty cool, I guess, but I'm not really interested in playing anymore. Hello? 
private. Consider this a final polite warning. Polite? Wait. Wait, this is a different one. This is Nathan's father. There's a message to let you know that attempts to slander and blackmail my son will be met with many lawyers and legal ramifications. What have I done? You're not the first student at Blackguard to try this. I hope you're the last. Consider the last. That's the final polite warning. Oh, I don't bloody know. What if it was him? Max, get over here. What gets over here? Can anyone here speak English? Warren is out and about already too. Looks like he's waiting for somebody. Yeah, me. Warren, what are you doing here? Oh, nothing. Waiting for a call? You got a bit of a black I eye. I took the call. Anyway, I wanted to rap about that action yesterday. Don't rap. Don't like you now. That was intense. Everything happened so fast. I owe you. Oh, yes you do. I got knocked on my ass by that dick. I'm some personal superhero. You look like one. You're a real everyday hero. You stood up to a bully and it was awesome. Even though you left me with said bully and ran off with that girl. Well, she's you pretty know. punk rock. How do you know her? We had sex one time. Just a pirate. I don't know. An old friend. Chloe Price. We haven't seen each other in a what while. What is the price? I bet you were glad to see her blast up in that truck like a rock star. Which begs the question, why is Nathan Prescott getting psycho on you? Because he's a twat. I busted him in the bathroom yesterday with a gun. Oh, probably shouldn't have said that. I'll give you the story later. Principal Wells is taking care of it now, I hope. We're fucking weak. Yeah. Like that bizarro snowfall yesterday? Speaking of dystopia, that driving is having a 70s Planet of the Apes marathon. Can I go watch Let's it? Let's go ape! Yeah. Sounds yes, fun. Yes, that's exactly what I need. I love those old school ape films. I've never seen them. Well, that was easier than I thought. Cool. I'll text you the info. She's giving him the bed eyes. Those half-closed eyes. Oh. Do we get to go on a pirate ship and get some booty? Not that Chloe's got much. Wait, not Chloe. Max. David talking to Nathan cannot be a good thing. Max hasn't got much of a this booty. This has something to do with Kate or Rachel. Even though I don't particularly care about the whole theme of the game, I guess of like college girls and the weird way they talk. Hi! <laughs> I guess I do care a bit about what's going on and I'm a, bit, I'm a bit worried for some of them. Especially Katie. Oh. No, no, not more music. Pet squirrel? Can you even keep squirrels as pets? I always said squirrels as squets. I'm sure some people probably have squirrel pets, but I guess they're just not typical pets. Hello, how do you do? There was a sign. Where are we going? I thought I was meeting Chloe for some dinner or something. For two whales. Oh, yeah, don't, don't fall asleep. You, you already hit snooze. That is a long ass bus. Hey, look, the lighthouse. I think that was up where we saw the tornado from. Oh. That's weird. I guess maybe... Maybe they're cons or are considered pests or something, I don't know. Wait, no, that's pigeons. 
then again, I don't know anything about Finland, so... Don't but... try to take it from me. It's mine. What? I wouldn't dream of it. Who are these people? Be a millionaire. Hope nobody steals my lottery. Talk about going back in time. Hi. The diner looks exactly the same. Does it? Well, yeah, it does. I've never seen it before, though. Hi. I bet he's seen a lot of changes to Arcadia Bay in his lifetime. Calling him old. Oh, bye. She looks busy and stressed. No, she doesn't. She's just standing there. It's anything but busy. Hi. You look lost. No, she Close. looks busy and stressed. Do you know if the bus has come yet? The online schedule isn't working. Didn't you just see it go past? She, was she not paying attention to the giant yellow bus that just went past? I guess it was the school bus, but I don't know. I just got off the school bus, but oh, okay. I'm sure the regular bus is coming too. Yeah. Oh, that's a relief. <laughs> I can't be late for this job interview. I can't believe I have to take a bus all the way to Newport just to find a second job. Yeah, what the hell, are man? Is that bad here? Where are things good? I can't even afford to <laughs> yeah. live here. Well, good luck. Thanks, I sure need it. By a random person who I just struck up a conversation with without knowing you. No time for chit chat. Oh, sorry. I'm a millionaire. Yep. Got my lottery ticket right here. Waiting for the bus so I can cash it in. Can I have it, actually? I'm a college student or something, so I need it more than you. Uh oh, what the dodginess is going on here? Shady business. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. They will. I am right now. Are you nobody? Wait, she did say nobody will read them. So yeah, I guess she is a nobody. Restore the life... Oh. Lifeblood of Arcadia Bay. Save our bay and the man-made drought in the bay. Bay. Yeah, bay, bay. Hi, dodgy geezer. He looks like a photo of the classic Arcadia Bay crusty fisherman. Crusty. Good morning. Looks like you're ready to catch some serious fish. Serious fish? I wish, young gal. Arcadia Bay just isn't the same fishing town I grew up in. Yeah, it is. It's the same one you grew up in, it's just changed. Has the town changed much? By Neptune's beard it has. Oh. Seems like a lifetime ago when I was king of the harbor. You did good. Did you? I don't know you. You did pretty good to have lasted this long. Oh, the fish used to jump onto my boat until the Prescotts and their finance fiends snapped up harbor rights. Prescott family. The Prescotts have a lot of power. And they might gun. rename the town Prescott Bay. If that tells you much. Yeah, it does. Bunch of twats. They own my school. Crooks gain respect when they put their names on schools and libraries. Let's not get downcast. I hear the fish calling for Bali High. Never forget that old fishermen never die. We just smell that way. Smell. I'd love to learn more, but I have to get going. Life is smelly. Happy fishing out there. Yep, see ya, dude. Oh, cool. Hopefully it ends up being good. It looks interesting from, from what they've shown so far. I don't know, Reptiloids. Curious about it. Hoping it'll be good. I like Cthulhu stuff. Especially Cthulhu slimy ass. There's oh. a dirty RV from the other day. No, not really. Oh, hi. Uh, stop that. Stop. No barking. Alright, see ya. Hi. There was something creepy about that guy and his dog was there. He's just ha having a relax on this lovely day. It does look like a nice day actually. Looks like the kind of day that wouldn't be too hot. And it might rain later which would be nice. Hole to another universe? Yes please. Guess not. There was a hole here. It's gone now. I don't want to go that way. Well, I do, and it's my game, so so do what I say. Oh well. I don't want to go that way. Get run over instead. So this rubbish game can no. Hi. 
by. Yes, we're open. Is that expensive for bacon and eggs? I don't know. Man. Snow. Well, that's a good start to the story. Boy, Mufkib. Were the service baffled by snow? In a rare admission, the National Weather Service has yet to come up with a conclusive reason for the unusual snowfall that briefly hit Arcadia Bay, Oregon this week. Probably nature, that's the reason. Things happen. I'm guessing you don't nope, want to. Nope, I don't no. want to go there. No. Why not? Some open world game. Oh, hi, Mufgeb. You're never away for long, it seems. Oh. Homeless. What is it? A homeless guy or homeless girl? Nothing, it's just homeless. Poor woman. Oh. I hope it's a shelter for her. Hello. Oh, look at you. Hi. A fine example of youth. I bet you're a senior student. I don't know. Yes, I go to Blackwell Academy. I could tell you're a wise young woman. I know all about Blackwell and this town. Oh, Prescott. I bet you have dirt on the Prescott family. That whole family is dirty. They once done good things for Arcadia. Everybody Bay. knows. Those days are dead. Like anything in their way. I know somebody who's being threatened by a Prescott. Then you be their guardian angel, because nothing gets in the way of that family, especially not the law. Hell, they own your school, Blackwell. Almost. Why is it not called Prescott High? Welcome back, Butane. Yeah, cause I have to explore everything. It's well annoying. How long have you lived in Arcadia Bay? A thousand years. Whoa! I've gone through the same changes as the town. Right, we can't take you seriously anymore then, can we? You're obviously lying, or a witch. What happened to you? What didn't happen to me? Sometimes you start out in life turned around the wrong way. I married dumb, made mistakes, got cheated out of my savings, lost my home, and now I hang out here. I'm sorry. Have you ever lived outside of here? What? Where the hell would I go? I hate the sun and love the mist. Sounds perfect. I might be homeless, but Arcadia Bay is still my home. Maybe I should marry her. No. But I do hate the sun and I enjoy mist. Especially the movie. 